um, Antiquity LSB Electric Guitar Heritage Cherry Sunburn. Hell O P Pull. Yes, I'm bringing that back again because it's funny. I bought a new guitar and amp. Now, I say I bought a new, it's the first ever guitar and amp I've ever bought because the first guitar and amp. I got was a Washburn my mum bought me which is a starter one very small amp so big it was great so I sold it I need to get rid of it because I got rid of it I went to my friend's house uh, he had a nice new guitar a nice Marshall amp all the pedals he had and I said oh nice I think I'm, I, I've always wanted to play the guitar Try, tried 20 years ago and never got the hang of it because it's all the um, you know the all the finger muscles you need to learn and muscle memory I'm learning slowly he said well I've got this one I've got this starter one I bought you can have it if you want it was a rock jam um, one and the guitar was okay but the amp that came with it was just dire but you, if you want to grunge like a dun 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 good luck so I was I researched for about three days yes I'm quite into my research I want to spend a lot of money on, on an amp and a guitar. I want to know what I want, what the best starter um, amps are. And it came with um, Marshall, Fender, Blackstar, um, Line 6 Cat Catalyst, not the Spider, but the Spider's rubbish, and Boss Katana Mark II. And I was like, okay, so I've got these five brands. I did a comparison. The Marshall sounded too boxy. The Fender sounded like it was in the opposite room you're playing. The Blackstar wasn't keen on it. So then it came down to the Boscatana and the Line 6 Catalyst. I researched them both um, and then found out that the, the Catalyst um, was a new one. From line six that, that that was trying to basically copy the Boss Katana. Boss Katana has been out for about six years apparently, but the only I liked the sound of the, of the Catalyst a lot, quite a bit more. It was more live and pure sound than the, the Katana. But the Katana had you could have multiple effects on at the same time, whereas the Catalyst could only have one effect on. I researched all these, went to a shop in Manchester, spoke to the guitar guy. And I said what, what I'm up to, what I want, what I don't want, what I'm looking for. And he said, here's a great guitar. We don't have any catalysts in, but here's a Boss Katana. You can get the 50, the 50 plus, I think it's called. The 100 or the 200. The 200 is going to be way too big for you. The 100 is slightly bigger than the 50. Um, the 50 plus is about 80 quid more and it just gives you the capability of having the effects pedal. I said, well, can I get other pedals that are for effects rather than having to get the, that their brand? He went, yeah, you don't have to have it with the not with the, just the 50 and not the 50 plus. Um, so I'm, I said, so I'm effectively paying an extra 80 pounds for the ability to have um, this effects pedal when I'm quite happily as a learner to not have an effects pedals at the minute, I can just I can adjust it myself um, on the top. Um, so I ended up getting a Boss Katana 50 Mark II, and then I said to the guy, um, "Well, I want a I like this uh, the Antiquity um, LS1 um, electric guitar. It's like a Les Paul." copy in heritage sunburn cherry um, and then he, what's this one this one's an LSB which is the one I got an LSB which is here I got this um, antiquity LSB electric guitar heritage cherry sunburn um, this was 139 pounds it has the uh, it has the the volume and the tone and volume and it has a little knob here basically this knob effectively when it's down like it is now it controls this 
and it's when it's in the middle like that it controls both and when you push it up it just controls that 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 board there but the grunt for the grunge what i'm learning currently i have it down at treble because rhythm is basically just a nice rhythm and obviously you've got the tone and the volume the um the uh strings aren't the most um Aren't, aren't the best. I might probably up, gonna upgrade them into they feel a bit flimsy, so I'll probably upgrade them. Um, but uh, I said to him, What's the difference between this one and the LS1? Because on the LS1, so you have um, that one and, that, and the other knob there will control the, the first one, the and then another knob there and there will control just the one. Pick up here. And obviously this knob, this little switch here, would be up here. So it's good for people who are in a band, which I'm not, who just basically want to, want to basically um, guitar, 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 flick up, flick down, quick change over depending what effect you want. So I so said, what's the difference? I said, well, basically, you effectively paying, it was £170 the one with the four knobs. So I said, well, you're effectively, I'm effectively paying another £35 just for two knobs that basically, to me, don't see the point at all. But I can just, I can flick between the different pickups here by the switch here, and then I can just set the tone and volume on there. That'll do for me. He said, well, I said, what will this do for me um, while I'm uh, learning? So I want a learner to an intermediate, because obviously I'm going to be an intermediate eventually when I'm learning. You should be out of the and then once you want to go even further, maybe you go to start gigging, then you go for say a five hundred pound um, guitar. So this was enough for me. Yes, I decided because the Line Six Catalyst was what that was what I wanted really, but the uh, the effects weren't. You, you can only use one effect at once, whereas the Boss Katana, you could use multiple effects at once. So, I got the Boss Katana, and like I said, I got the 50 Mark II because um, I got told for what I need it for, the 100 is okay, and to be honest, I've only got it on 25 watts, not 50 watts anyway, because 25 watts is plenty for what I want it. If I want to go higher, I might do. But at the minute, 25 is enough. Um, it's very loud when I put the master volume and the volume up, the normal volume and the master volume up. Um, it is pretty good. Um, here it is. The Boss Katana 50 Mark II. Um, the good thing is, is you've got, you put your headphones in. So if, you, if your wife, your girlfriend, your kids, or your neighbors, it's, and you want to play on it, you put your headphones in there and you can put, and you're just annoying yourself. You've got the foot controls, so like, where's the Boss Katana 50 Plus or the 100 200 comes with the effect pedal? You can get it, you can't get it with this, but non Boss pedals and plug them into there, and you can get the same effect. You know, all the all the actual Boss Katana um, uh, uh, pedal is for the effect pedal is for quick switching if you're at a gig, but I'm not going to be gigging with this, and if I am, then. I'll figure it out from there, I'll just get pedals and learn how to use the pedals. You've got the USB here, which is basically if you want to plug it into your laptop and use the advanced settings with the um, with the Boss uh, app that you can get auxiliary in. You've got your power lead. Um, you've obviously got the big ass thing, at, and up here, you probably can't see it. Um, because it's too far away, but you just have the line in for the obviously you take the line out of the guitar line into here You've got the various modes So you just press some um, Variations at the top here and change you can open it out the also the other reason why I got this is because the catalyst didn't have an acoustic thing so it basically um, makes it sound like an acoustic guitar and say you're out gigging or whatever and then somebody says, oh let's play an acoustic version of this I can flick it onto acoustic and it sounds just like an acoustic guitar or it, or it it's, does it the best it damn well can so I got that's the reason why I got that 
The gain is obviously gives it that do 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 type of thing. Um, volume is self-explanatory. You got the bass, which I don't really pull. I put up. I put it and leave that at twelve o'clock normally. Mid, the mid when I put it about nine o'clock, which is all less mids. Treble about the same quarter two to um, twelve o'clock. You have a boost function, so basically just boost the volume, boost boost the effects you're using. Uh, you, it it's good as well because it adds um, two dials and that you can you can turn it up, up and then you turn it on. Um, it has the effects button, it has the del de delay, I don't like to say delay, I'm not an American, I'm English. It has the delay button and basically when it has the delay button it has a thing down here that says tap. And I, was, I said to the person, what the heck does tap mean? And basically what it means is when it lights up, the more you press it, the quicker it flashes. There's more of me because so it's going duh, duh, you go duh, 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 duh. So basically, the, the slower the flashing, the longer the effect lasts in one gulp. The quicker it is, the more you get, the more, the more duh, 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 duh you get. Reverb is it, obviously. Basically, the same as the delay, but the reverb is just like a. If you ever go into a hallway and you say hello and it goes hello, 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 whatever, that's basically reverb. Your sound is reverberating off the walls, off the ceiling, wherever, because it's an echoey room. It's basically an air reverb, it's just an, a, 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 um, another word for echo. Um, master is just a master volume. You've got your power stuff, it's just standby, not 0.5 watts, 25 watts, and 50 watts. And then you've got your channels, which is just basically just for your effects, basically. Channel 1, channel 2, you can, so you can sort of like. Uh, Decide what effects you want and stuff. You press and hold channel one and it logs it. You, do it and you want another one for a different effect, you press channel two, press and hold, it logs it. Um, I, don't know, I don't know what the panel one is, but it's just this is tone setting, so that's basically what it is. So this is what I bought. Now this was 230. The one, the, the 50 plus, which was basically just meant that main I could have the effect pedal with it was 300 and something like 20. I wasn't gonna pay 80, 90 quid for the, to be able to have an effect pedal when I could just go and buy some other effect pedals that will work with multiple um, amps. So I didn't bother, I got the cheaper one. And me go buy cheap, buy twice. No, this is a good starter one. So there's my, the one, that, that that I got. Um, so I'm very happy with this so far. There is a few things I need to figure out because basically I've got the Boss Katana 50 Mark II, which I'm very happy with at the minute. Although I wish the Catalyst had did all that that did because I would have got the Catalyst instead. I may get the Catalyst down the line. I may sell this and then the Catalyst comes out with some better updates. I really prefer the sound, the more not natural, raw sound of the Catalyst from Line 6. And obviously my... Uh, my guitar, which is the Antiquity LSB Sunburn Orange Red, whatever, and it's great. I don't have to unscrew it from the back because the, the other guitar had the cheap one. You had to unscrew something from the back there to thread the, um, the strings through. Whereas this one, you don't have to. The strings go through the bottom, the bottom of the thing there. Go up, up, up. Hope you like this video. Um, tell me what you think. Um, if there's some songs you think are good for learners, or any links you think are good to help people learn different. But I don't know what the keys are called, even though I'm doing them. I need to write them down. But to be honest, I don't really care what the keys are to a point, as long as it's I know what they, what's how they sound. I'm happy with that. Follow my progress of learning. I'm going to. Um, videos as I learn songs as I get used to how to use this gear better let's see if in the next this time next year which is February so February 2024 see if I've if I've, if I've upgraded my guitar if I've made if I've made this guitar and I'm amazing at it and how and you know see what see see how good I've got or how bad I've got um, I'm gonna try and do an hour a day maybe, half an hour a day, an hour a day, 
playing because he perhaps makes perfect. We'll do some shots. I'll be playing the guitar soon as I go and I'll do longer stuff um, as I get better. Um, hope you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, thumbs up for me, nice one, comment and I'll see you all soon for hopefully another enjoyable um, video. So what can I say? Um, that's it. Bye bye.